man with all the pressure on his shoulders this afternoon from the USA, the winner. Can he do it here? Fastest in qualifying. And again, oh. my word, he wasn't even on any line there. He just sent it straight through the middle. I saw that in his qualifying run and didn't think he'd meant to do it. Okay, it looks like he's now changing his strategy for the final here. Oh my word, he looks to be on a different pace. What we've seen of him so far, Aaron Gwynn. Sensational on that top drop. Oh yes, oh yes. Look he's at this. early, he's early. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we've been treated so yeah. special. Two seconds, two seconds at the top of this track. That's impossible, that's impossible. Gwynn, we've never seen a rider like him in mountain biking. I don't think we've ever seen any rider with a pace of this man. And what is, is this? <laughs> Look how he goes through those books. Lost a bit in that turn there, but he's got two, th two seconds to waste. So just stay on your bike, Aaron. Again, plenty of encouragement from the crowd here. Winner here in 11 and 12, second last year. He's never finished off the podium here in the USA. Look at coming this. Up, coming up to the rocks, doesn't get high there to oh, the oh, right. Oh, oh, oh. Doesn't get set up as well as he'd like. Oh, wow, <laughs> he's hanging on through the rocks there. Didn't lose too much time. The split will tell us now. His advantage, very nearly two seconds at split number one. This is incredible stuff. Oh, yes, he is still up. He is up. He is up by three, seconds. three seconds now. This should make Louis Bruni feel a little bit bad because I don't think even he would have been able to beat this man today. So just one turn to go. Aaron Gwynn is on an amazing run. And we've been lucky enough to see almost top to bottom here today. The crowd are going wild. They're running on the track behind him. Aaron Gwynn is coming down to the line now, surely to take the win. Look at the time. Over three and a half seconds on a track of just over two and a half minutes. That is one of the best race runs I have ever seen.